Why not? What? Mm. Be right back. Okay. Hopefully, I'm back. Exit. started selling androids. I made a few calls. Here we are. Ooh, it's you from the main menu. Hi. for the android. Connor, do you like him? Do you, nah, not him. These androids haven't been a bad thing for everybody. Connor, do you like her? Uh, you're about to meet your maker, Connor. How's it feel? It doesn't raise any existential questions, if that's what you mean. Sometimes I wish I could meet my creator face to face. You mean your parents? I'd have a couple of things I'd want to tell him. We'll see you now. Is that a pool of blood? Mr. Kamsky? And hot chicks in bikinis? Just a moment, please.
I'm Lieutenant Anderson. This is Connor. What can I do for you, Lieutenant? Sir, we're investigating deviants. I know you left Cyberlife years ago, but I was hoping you'd be able to tell us something we don't know. Deviants. Fascinating, aren't they? Perfect beings with infinite intelligence. Now they have free will. Machines are so superior to us. Confrontation was inevitable. Humanity's greatest achievement threatens to be its downfall. Isn't that right? Oh, shit. Deviancy seems to spread like some kind of virus. I thought you might know something about that. Okay, I'm ready now. All ideas of viruses spread like epidemics. Is the desire to be free a contagious disease? Listen, I didn't come here to talk philosophy. The machines you created may be planning a revolution. Either you can tell us something that'll be helpful, or we will be on our way. What about you, Connor? Whose side are you on? I'm on the human side, of course. <laughs> well, that's what you're programmed to say. But you. What do you really want? I don't want anything. I am a machine. Chloe? Chloe is a name. Turing test. Here from now on. Simple question of algorithms and computing capacity. What interests me is whether machines are capable of empathy. I call it the Kamsky test. It's very simple, we'll see. Magnificent, isn't it? One of the first intelligent models developed by CyberLife. Young and beautiful forever. A flower that will never wither. What is it really? A piece of plastic containing a human? Or a living being? <laughs> With a soul? It's up to you to answer that fascinating question, Connor. Destroy this machine, and I'll tell you all I know. Or spare it, if you feel it's alive. But you'll leave here without having learned anything from me. Okay, I think we're done here. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you What's out of here. What's more important pool? to you, Connor? Your investigation or the life of this android? Uh, the second one. An obedient machine. Or a living being. Endowed with free will. That's enough. Connor, we're leaving. Pull the trigger. Connor! Don't! And I'll tell you what you want to know. I almost press circle. Cyberlife's last chance to save humanity is itself a deep. I'm. I'm not a deviant. You prefer to spare a machine rather than accomplish your mission. You saw a living being in this android. You should. A war is coming. You'll have to choose your side. Will you betray your own people or stand up against your creators? What can be worse than having to choose between two evils? Let's get out of here. By the way, I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. 
You never know. Mm. Why didn't you shoot? I just saw that girl's eyes, and I couldn't. That's all. You're always saying you would do anything to accomplish your mission. That was our chance to learn something, and you let it go. Yeah, I know what I should have done. I told you I couldn't. I'm sorry, okay? Well, maybe you did the right thing. Yeah. Thanks, Hank. Kinship. What? I don't know, man. This is for you. Okay, I'm done. I needed to see the daylight. I like it here. I come here often. It's like being alone with the world. We freed hundreds of our people and they're still coming from all over the city. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. Something's changing. seem preoccupied. I panicked last night. We should have succeeded. I cannot afford to make mistakes like that. All the media are talking about what we did last night. The humans are terrified. They're afraid of a civil war. Many of our people were burned in response to what happened. The humans hate us. They'll never give us our freedom. If they won't listen. We'll fight. You haven't said much about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? I was caring for an old man. He was like a father to me. He showed me that humans and androids can live together. Yes. What about you? You never told me about your past. What did you do before? I don't want to talk about it. North, we're fighting together. We have to know things about each other to trust each other. We all have something we want to forget. But you need to know where you come from to know who you are. Companion. Uh-oh. A doll in a distributor program to satisfy him. Just a toy designed for their pleasure. So the eating club. The eating One club. A man. Without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. I strangled him and I ran away. 
Oh, you killed the guy. So it was you and Amelia. Gotcha. Lever. It just said lever. I saw your memories too. The Eden Club. Yeah. The death of that man. I felt like I was there with you. North. What? My lover under north. I thought it was. I thought we were gonna kiss. But no, she just did. This is suicide. We'll all be killed. Please, Marcus. It's not too late to change your mind. You don't understand. We're finally gonna show them who we really are. This place will go down in history. We'll be killed on the spot. That's the risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people. Marcus, please don't do this. They'll understand. We'll make them understand. This is the only way. Rally your people. There are androids here who could join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. You're free. <laughs> oh, fuck. Is that Todd? Wait, what? Where do you think you're going? You get back here. Hmm. Open manhole cover. Shit. I was gonna go convert that guy. Now we can just look at them. March. Oh, 
Oh, fuck. Come on, Greg, ignore it. I need a fucking minigun. I got a lot of androids down here. Just mow them all down. I don't know, hundreds, <laughs> thousands. Of... Oh, we're supposed to keep moving. They're marching. We're supposed to keep moving. Yeah, they're marching down the street. Fucking body. Got the fucking SWAT. We're being swatted. Right here on Twitch. Who called me out? We came here to demonstrate peacefully and tell humans that we are living beings. All we want is to live free. This is an illegal gathering. Disperse immediately or we will open fire. We're not looking for confrontation. We've done no harm. We have no intention of doing any. But know that we are not going anywhere until we have secured our freedom. I repeat, this is an illegal gathering. If you do not disperse immediately, we will shoot. Marcus, they're gonna kill us. We have to attack. There's more of us, we can take them. That is true. We'll start a war. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand our ground, even if it means dying here. This is your last chance. Disperse immediately, or you will all be killed! Don't do it, Marcus. Don't choose confrontation. I'm sorry, but they're gonna kill us. Me. They're gonna kill us. Oh, 
Disarm. Um, I did. Who? Attack. Um, I did. Are you impressed now, Nork? My love? Oh no. Public opinion hated. I mean, they have to hate us. Actually, no, they should be scared of us. Confrontation. <sighs> awesome. Got all this up here. Dr. Amanda. What is this? What is that? Is that the emergency exit Kinski talked about? I think so. I don't know. Oh, there she is. <clears throat> Uh, 
After what happened today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. I thought Kemsky knew something. I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. That is true. I chose not to play his twisted little game. There was no reason to kill that android. Distrusted. Good. I don't trust her anyways. Created the first version. It's been improved significantly since then. Why do you ask? Uh... I'm not a unique model, am I? How many Connors are there? I don't see how that question pertains to your investigation. I saw a photo of Amanda at Kamsky's place. She was his teacher. I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. How much time do we got left? You're the only one who can prevent civil war. Oh, we got three minutes. Okay. Find the deviants. Or there will be chaos. This is your last chance, Connor. Okay, guys. I'm gonna end the stream there. I'm gonna end the stream there. Hope you guys have enjoyed. If you did, leave a like on the stream, subscribe, comment, share. And, uh, yeah. I might be back later tonight. So, uh, yeah. See you later.